day. Before joining Akilidada, my world was pretty small. I grew up in Kitale, it's in the western side of Kenya. Uh, in the countryside, people are farmers, so you're a bright kid. You go to high school, get a good grade, go to medicine, get a stable career. That's it, that's the end of your dream. That's the end of my life, that's what my life was. When Akildada walked into my life, I can see my whole world exploded. New opportunities, new ideas, new thoughts that have not really been in my, had not been in my small world before. I discovered new careers, new parts of life, people who actually follow their passion. Got a lot of inspiration from amazing women from all over the world and all the cool things they're doing. I think the biggest thing in that world bursting was discovering the power I had. At Akildada we have, we have these movie nights where we watch the lives of a bunch of awesome Kenyan, on and Kenyan women in history and some who are still alive and just get to discuss all the cool things they've done, the changes they've made in their society, the impact they've had in people's life, lives and that has really opened my eyes to the power I hold as a person, not as a black <laughs> young woman. It's not about my gender, my age, or my race. It's just as a human being, the power that I have, the impact I'm able to have on people's lives. And I feel really motivated to do that because I know I can do that before it was really not in my mind to think of such things. That's what Akildada is to me. I'm currently setting up a developer school in Nairobi to teach people how to program and introduce them to the field. It's, I can say it's a really cool thing to do <laughs> in Nairobi and at 19 and the kind of partnerships and um, the whole structure of the dev school. I think it's, it's amazing. If I could go back to that world busting idea I was talking about before Kilidada, I would have never thought, you know, I've just finished high school. I can have the idea and the passion to develop and start a developer school and actually do it. But seeing others doing awesome things actually made me realize, hey, you can do this. And I really believed in it and it's happening. We are launching in the next two weeks, which is really awesome. Um, yeah, I'm really psyched up about it. And the motivation and power to do that, I can directly attribute to the training I've gone through the past five years as an Akeidada sister. I think the dev school is really essential, not just in Nairobi but for Africa, because it's the only way, because the only way we'll develop Africa in different sectors. Africa has been known to receive stuff, I'd say, and it's bugged me for so long that Africans, we're not consciously developing our own continent. Because I like to tell people, whatever is in other countries, someone actually created it. Someone sat down and a bunch of people decided to work on this and people worked on that. And until, as Africans, we work on certain things, it won't just appear from nowhere. We won't develop amazing systems and improve our different sectors from health to education unless we actually just sit down and do it. I think the dev school would be very essential in doing that because technology is key in every sector. We're not just working on gaming software or design or banking or a specific field. It's a developer school and by giving people the power to program, that's education that they can use in whatever field they're passionate about, hence develop Africa. Yeah, so I think it's really key.